just picked these up. Really good price at Best Buy. $19.99. And um, simple idea. Simple headphones. I'll have this all at the end. So I'm going to play a description of the item as I'm unboxing it. Insignia wireless over the ear headphones black model. NES. CAHBTOE01 SKU 5759922040520020. Cost $19.99. Best Buy. Insignia TM. Wireless over the ear headphones. Black model. NES. CAHBTOE01 SKU 5759922. Overview description walk around while you listen with these insignia over the ear Bluetooth headphones. Pair these comfortable earphones, which have a 33 foot range and a reliable Bluetooth 4.0 interface, with your computer or smart device to stream music wirelessly. These insignia over the ear Bluetooth headphones have a built in microphone and inline controls, which let you take calls easily. Headphone buying guide features Bluetooth interface enables simple wireless pairing with your Bluetooth enabled device. Rechargeable battery offers up to 10 hours of music playback. Built in microphone enables simple hands free chatting via compatible device. Stereo design delivers crisp tones, over the ear design for comfort during extended listening sessions. What's included 3.5mm audio cable insignia TMNS. CAHBTOE01 wireless over the ear headphones USB charging cable. Specifications key spec sound mode stereo connection type wireless wireless connectivity info Bluetooth true wireless info no maximum wireless range 33 feet built in microphone yes headphone fit over the ear adjustable headband yes battery life info 10 hours general product name wireless over the ear headphones brand insignia TM model number NS. Capto 01 color black color category black audio sound isolating no sound mode stereo connectivity connection type wireless wireless connectivity info Bluetooth true wireless info no maximum wireless range 33 feet features built in microphone yes design headphone fit over the ear style travel adjustable headband yes power rechargeable yes battery life info 10 hours charging interface s Info USB warranty manufacturer's warranty. Parts one year manufacturer's warranty. Labor one year other UPC 600,603,211,669. Quick setup guide Bluetooth over the ear headphones NES. CAHBTOE01 NS. CAHBTOE01 C package contents. Bluetooth over the ear headphones. USB charging cable. 3.5 mm audio cable. Quick setup guide. Find your user guide online. Go to www.insigniaproducts.com. Enter your model in the search box. Then press enter. Next to features. Click support and downloads. Then next to user guide. Click the language you want. Features. Comfortable foam earpods. Volume control. Listen to music and talk on the phone wirelessly. Music playback. 10 hours, echo cancellation and noise suppression, voice prompts and easy pairing, high quality sound press and hold more than 2 seconds press and hold more than 3 seconds press and hold more than 4 seconds in power off mode press and release button press and release plus semicolon button press and release button press and hold button before using your new product. Please read these instructions to prevent any damage. Bluetooth basic indication Bluetooth function indication action power on power off pairing mode play pause volume up down previous track next track fast rewind fast forward incoming call answer call reject call redial reset device list operation description 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 micro USB port function press plus to increase the volume press to turn on your stereo headphones if you receive a phone call press to talk Press to pair your headphones with the Bluetooth enable device. Press to skip to the previous track fast rewind. Press to skip to the next track fast forward. Press to decrease the volume. Shows current status of the headphones. Allows you to talk on the telephone. Connect one end of the included audio cable to the headset's audio jack and the other end to the music device's headphone jack. Plug the micro USB connector into this port to charge your headphones. 
Press and release when a call is incoming plus volume up. Power talk play pause pairing. Button next track previous track. Volume down indicator LED microphone 3.5 mm audio jack press and hold when a call is incoming double press long press button more than 5 seconds in power off mode charging your stereo headphones. When the red indicator LED blinks 3 times every minute and the voice prompt says battery low, the battery is low. To charge the battery, plug the charging cable into your computer and into the micro USB port on your headphones. The red LED turns on to indicate that the battery is charging and turns off when fully charged. Red LED flashes 10 times using with the audio cable you can use your headset with non-Bluetooth enabled devices or on airplanes, in which the use of Bluetooth may be restricted by taking advantage of the headset's audio jack. Cordlet operation does not require battery power for music listening. The microphone and the full sound digital sound enhancement will not work via the audio cable. Note. Finish your call before connecting the audio jack, as this will switch off battery power and cut an ongoing call. LED indication blue LED lights for 1.5 seconds red LED lights for 1.5 seconds blue and red LED blinking alternately blue LED blinks 3 times every 5 seconds when a call is received sound power on power off. 2 short beeps 2 high beeps for maximum volume ringtone 1 long beep 2 long beeps 2 short beeps using your stereo headphones turning your stereo headphones on and off 1 plus a their headphone is an ear head 2 press and hold but on mirth and 2 seconds the lead links blue when turned on or red when turned off and the voice prompt says power on or power off pairing your stereo headphones notes range is 33 feet 10 meters support c zippering Prompt Sayaba saying your Davis is connected. When connected, capital S U P P O R T S A B A T T E R Y I N D I C A T O R I C O N O. Pairing with a cell phone or MP3 player 1. Capital W I T H Y O U R S T E R E O H E A D P H O N E S T U R N E D. Press and hold for 4 seconds. The blue and red LEDs blink alternately to on your phone or MP3 player. Select Insignians Capto 01 from the list of Discover devices. Then enter the password 0000, four zeros, if required, to pair your headphones. For more information on pairing Bluetooth devices to your cell phone or MP3 player, see the device's documentation. Note, after the headphones have been successfully paired with the cell phone or MP3 player, the headphones will automatically reconnect to the phone or MP3 player. Pairing with a computer running Windows Note. Before you pair the headphones with the computer, make sure that the computer is equipped with Bluetooth. Refer to the computer's documentation or contact the computer manufacturer for more information. If your computer is not Bluetooth compatible, install a Bluetooth USB adapter. Dongle 1 Turn on Bluetooth on the computer. For instructions, see the computer's documentation or contact the computer manufacturer to double-click the Bluetooth icon in the system tray. Then click Add a device. Add wireless device using Windows Vista 3 with the headphones turned off. Press and hold for 4 seconds. The LED blinks blue and red alternately. Pairing mode is activated for double click the insignia NS. CAHBTOE01 icon on the computer or highlight the icon. Then click Next. Note If you are unable to locate the insignia NS. CAHBTOE01 icon. Click the search again button 5 if required. Enter 0000 four zeros in the Bluetooth security code field. Then click next 6 after the headphones have been paired. Click close. Note, to make your headphone the default playback device, refer to the user guide. Pairing with a Mac computer note, before you pair the headphones with the computer, make sure that the computer is Bluetooth compatible. Refer to the computer's documentation or contact the computer manufacturer for more information. If your computer is not Bluetooth compatible, install a Bluetooth USB adapter. Dongle 1 Turn on Bluetooth on the computer for instructions. 
see the computer's documentation or contact the computer manufacturer or to click the Bluetooth status menu 3 click setup Bluetooth device the Bluetooth setup assistant opens 4 click continue 5 select headset aesthetic as type then click continue 6 with the head finish turn it off press and hold for 4 seconds the LED blinks blue and red alternately pairing mode is activated 7 select insignians capto 01 then click continue the computer gathers information 8 click continue 9 enter 0000, 0, 0, 0 4 ZRS, into the passkey field. Then click continue 10 click quit a finish. Note, to use the headphones, they must be selected as the default input and output device on the computer 11 click system preferences. Then click sound 12 under input, select insignians capto 01, then under output, select insignia NS. CAHBTOE01. For more information on using your headphones with Skype, refer to your user guide. Resetting your stereo headphones. To reset your headphones, with your stereo headphones turned off, press and hold the power button for 5 seconds. The LED blinks red 10 times, indicating that your headphones have entered pairing mode. Specifications Bluetooth version. Supported profiles. Frequency spectrum. Working distance, operating temperature, operating time, standby time, size, weight, average charging time, Bluetooth 4.1 A2DP, AVRCP, HFP, HSP 2.4 to 2.4 A35 GHz ISM band up to 33 feet, 10 meters, 23 122 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 550 degrees Celsius, talk, 10 hours music. 10 hours, playback music track up to 200 hours 6.3 x 2.9 x 7.1 inches, 16.1 x 7.3 x 18.0 centimeters, 6.42 ounces, 182 G, 2 hours troubleshooting, reset your BD headphone, plug in the micro USB cable for charging legal notices FCC statement, this device complies with part 15 of the FCC rules. Operation is subject to the following two conditions. 1. This device may not cause harmful interference. And 2. This device must accept any interference received, including interference that may cause undesired operation. FCC caution. Changes or modifications not expressly approved by the party responsible for compliance could void the user's authority to operate the equipment. FCC statement. Note. This equipment has been tested and found to comply with the limits for a Class B digital device. Pursuant to Part 15 of the FCC rules, these limits are designed to provide reasonable protection against harmful interference in a residential installation. This equipment generates, uses and can radiate radio frequency energy and, if not installed and used in accordance with the instructions, may cause harmful interference to radio communications. However, there is no guarantee that interference will not occur in a particular installation. If this equipment does cause harmful interference to radio or television reception, which can be determined by turning the equipment off and on, the user is encouraged to try and correct the interference by one or more of the following measures. Comma reorient or relocate the receiving antenna. Increase the separation between the equipment and receiver. Connect the equipment into an outlet on a circuit different from the to which the receiver is connected. Consult the dealer or an experienced radio TV technician for help. RSS Gen and RSS 247 Statement This device complies with Industry Canada License Exempt RSS Standard. S. Operation is subject to the following two conditions. 1. This device may not cause interference. And. 2. This device must accept any interference, including interference that may cause undesired operation of the device. Le present a perilous state conform acts CNRD Industry Canada applicable acts of perils radio exempts to license. L exploitation estate or Taurus A acts due conditions suvents. 1. L a perilous nedoit pa produire de brow illage. At. 2. Elitalis at your dial a period doit accept your tout brow illage radio electric subi. Mime C li brow illage estate susceptible de comprometer li function ermint. RSS 102 statement this equipment complies with Industry Canada radiation exposure limits set forth for an uncontrolled environment. 
CET Equipment Estate Conform RL Exposition Axe Rayonments Industry Canada Limites Ada Blaze Poor Un Environment Non Control A. Operation of this device is subject to the following two conditions. 1. This device may not cause harmful interference. And 2. This equipment or device must accept any interference received, including interference that may cause undesired operation. One year limited warranty visit www. Dot insignia products dot com for details contact insignia one eight seven seven four six seven four two eight nine u s and canada are zero one eight zero zero nine two six three zero 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 mexico www dot insignia products dot com i insignia is a trademark of best buy and its affiliated companies distributed by best buy purchasing LLC 7601 Penave South, Richfield, Minnesota, 55423 USA Copyright Sign, 2018 Best Buy, All Rights Reserved, Made in China V2 English 18-0300. Okay, after using and testing them, testing these uh, headphones out now, I'm not a professional. I am a regular guy, just like gadgets. That's it. Not a professional person. Just a regular Joe Schmo. Barely reads the instruction manual. Yes, I should do it. But I like to get the product, try to figure it out, use it, try different things. Um, I do go to the manual when I have to. But overall, I just touch them, see how easy it is to set up without reading the manual. And that way, it gives me more, uh, more of an impression on the actual device. And... Um, it, it it shows me the ease of use or the not very easy of use. So that being said, uh, after using these for a couple of days, I gotta tell you, I really like them. I mean, wow, I cannot believe. Now, I have a pair of Bose headphones. I mean, those are the best, they're all beat up. I've had them for years now. They're light as a feather in your head and uh, you don't feel them. I, I don't know what they do, the comfort level, the, the audio level, everything works great, okay? But they cost over $300. For $20, these are excellent. I literally got, let me make sure I, I wrote some things down. So the range is definitely limited to about 30 feet. That's me walking away, and after about 30 feet, I'd say 25 is perfect. Anything above 25 feet, it starts to fade. 30 feet, it's gone. So you're not the greatest super signal if you have this on your, connected to your TV or uh, your computer. Uh, or your phone would be fine, you have it in your pocket. And then 30 feet of weight, no problem. There's no noise cancellation, so you know, yeah, you know, I mean, it's twenty dollar headphones, and uh, but I was pretty surprised it lasted fourteen hours of continuous use. I was using this; I had audio running through these things for fourteen hours straight. Okay, you long YouTube channels, uh, music, anything, and I had it on my headphone uh, while I was watching TV. So the the uh, shows came over well. I could hear them. Everything was fine. They were comfortable. I, they were oddly as much uh, very comfortable for technically a cheap set of headphones. They were comfortable enough. Uh, they weren't heavy. They're pretty light. They weren't heavy. These are very cushiony. No issues whatsoever. I don't know if in time these will wear and, it be, and it'll be a different story. But for now, they work very well. And uh, it gives you comfort level, audio level. Uh, I made a couple of phone calls. The phone calls are, are okay. They're not AirPods. I mean, AirPods are awesome. Um, I did make a couple of phone calls. They came over well. Everything worked. No issues. I mean, for $20, they definitely well worth a set of headphones. I mean, these are excellent gifts. Excellent audio devices if you just you know, need one in a pinch or want to keep one, you know, for your TV and one for your computer for the price. I mean, compared to a set of bows, you know, you can buy 15 of these. So 
you know, it's up to you. So I like them. I really am impressed by them and the quality for $20. Uh, I don't think I'd pay anything more than $20, but for the most part, they're, they're, I have no complaints. They, I charge them overnight, and like I said, 14 hours of continuous audio, 14 hours. So the audio, I mean, lasted forever. You can use the jack that comes with it to plug it in directly. You forget to charge these and you just need a to plug it in and you just need to have a set phones without power. You could actually just plug in the 3.5 jack into this. And um, let me see if I can get it close. So, and you can listen to music or whatever you want to listen to with these jacks without power. They work without power. You don't need to have this on to use these as a standard plug-in headset headphones. So they work that way also. I mean, you don't have to use Bluetooth. You can physically connect it and you don't even have to worry about power. They work just fine. And um, that's it, that, you know, that's a, <clears throat> two great options. Wireless, not wireless, no power, power charge, doesn't matter. And um, again, for $20, I was pretty, pretty impressed. It's. It's a good set of headphones for that price, definitely. I don't know how much they regularly go for. I guess you you might be able to see the price down below when you click on the link. Uh, but it's pretty cool. It's a great price, great item for the price. I like Insignia brands. I buy their batteries, I buy a lot of their items. They work well. So I hope the video helps. I hope it was informative. Thank you. Bye.